Major changes are coming to the lineup of Thunder over Louisville with less than two weeks until the big show. Corey Pippen has, uh, was there. He has a look at what we can expect. Excitement for Thunder over Louisville is sky high. Tuesday, officials announced the lineup. 80 performers, including about 10 military aircraft. Some things we haven't seen before or haven't been here in a long time. We have an aerobatic team coming in from Canada. Uh, we have UPS flying, one of their 767s. We have the Harrier demo team, which is really tremendous. That's a neat aircraft to watch come to a dead stop in the middle of the box. The U.S. Air Force Thunderbirds and the Army Golden Knight Parachute Team will headline, followed by the largest fireworks show in the country. But due to FAA regulations, the Thunderbirds' nearly hour-long show has been cut significantly. Officials say they were told by the FAA on Friday that the jets will not perform aerobatic maneuvers. They say obstructions in the airspace, including bridge construction, change the category of Thunder's airbox. An aircraft which exceed a certain cruising speed are no longer allowed. We will not have them functioning as an aerobatic team with six planes, but they are still sending two aircraft to do uh, multiple passes through and show off the Thunderbirds' abilities and do all their community things as well. Officials say the change is disappointing, but extra acts have been added to make up for the loss, including Team Aerodynamics, the world's largest air show team. We're going to see individual planes doing aerobatics, team doing aerobatics, some teams of four, some teams of six, some teams of 11. You're going to see a tremendous air show. Corey Pippen, WLKY News.